I'm Chris Porritt, VP of Vehicle Engineering at Tesla Motors. What I'm here to tell you about today is the Model S and how this car performs outstandingly in winter conditions. In fact, all-wheel drive is not required at all when you have this car. With our Roadster programme, we learned there was a huge passion for our products, especially in Northern Europe. We learned a massive amount from those customers and we've been able to use all of that knowledge and information and feed that into the Model S. To date, thousands of Model S customers have been driving their cars in snow-covered winters all around the world. In fact, one of our best customers, who owns more than half a dozen Teslas, lives above the Arctic Circle. The Model S has a very advanced cooling system. This allows us to be able to divert the heat that we generate in the motor and actually maintain the temperature within the battery compartment. This heating system can be set when you get up in the morning using your mobile phone app. You can set the car to warm, which means by the time you've had a shower and had your breakfast, you can be out in a fully warmed up car, which maintains the range of your battery. The other thing the Model S has is a traction control system, which in low grip conditions works fantastic with a car. In an IC engine car, the motor, transmission, axles take a long time to speed up and slow down. The Model S has an electric motor which has very low inertia, which means that the motor can be spun up or slowed down very, very quickly, almost instantaneously in fact. It takes input from the driver, from the steering system, from wheel speeds, and it basically gives you the best traction that you can possibly have in that environment. So it was said that it wasn't possible to make a family sedan that's electric, that seats seven people, that's as capable as it is. This is basically redefined a sedan for all environment conditions.